you're looking for adventure, you want to unwind, pick up a good story, get out of that old grind and read a book. Read, 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 read a book, read a book, read, read. Hello, Storybook Pals. Cody O'Bear here, your reading ambassador. I want to welcome you back to Storytime. As always, whether it's your first visit or one of many, we are going to have a great time. As you know, on Storytime, I introduce you to books and readers from all over that love to read to children. Today, my pal, Mr. Jeff, will be reading the book, The Magical Yet. What? That's a very interesting title for sure. Now, this book is about the many things we want to do, but we haven't been able to do yet. So, let's check it out. And now, The Magical Yet. Words by Angela Di Trelizzi. Art by Lorena Alvarez. There are days when your dreams haven't come true. Or you're upset by the things you can't do. If you've lost or failed or cried just a bit, you're tired of waiting, ready to quit. Like that shiny new bike you couldn't ride, and it didn't matter how hard you tried. You couldn't pedal, and you couldn't steer, and you couldn't get that bike into gear. Then, when you thought you were on the right track, you popped a wheelie and fell on your back. And now you won't ride. No way. Not never. No riding for you. You'll walk. Forever. Don't give up now. There's a major game changer. A most amazing thought rearranger. Someone to show you how good you can get. Now introducing... The Magical Yet. With this Yet's magic, you can begin to see that you're going beyond where you've been. There are so many things that you've learned to do when you didn't know the Yet was with you. Like when you babbled before you could talk or how you crawled before you could walk. Yet's a dreamer, a schemer, a hoper, a trier, a maker, a doer, a got a high flyer. This yet finds a way, even when you don't, and yet knows you will, when you think you won't. Like that shiny new bike that you couldn't ride, hop right back on with the yet by your side. Yet doesn't mind warm-ups, fixes and flops, do-overs, redos, stumbles and stops. Yet knows there's mistakes, some big and some small. With yet, you're sure to get over them all. Play the gazoo, or play the bassoon. Jam with the yet, and you'll soon be in tune. Try skateboarding tricks, like the ollie heel flip. This yet can get to the championship. Tongue twisters twisted, your tongue in a knot. Yet says, keep trying and practice a lot. Be patient. Yet can't do it all overnight. Some things take days, months, or years to get right. But if you keep leaping, dreaming, wishing, waiting, learning, trying, missing, with the yet as your guide, along the way, you'll do all the things you can't do today. Now you're bolder, braver, starting to see. With yet, you can get where you want to be. You finally did it! Yet knew you could. You're not just writing, you're getting quite good. But don't stop now. You've got so much to do. The good news is, this yet grows with you. So no matter how big or old you may get, you'll never outgrow, you'll never forget. You can always believe in the magical yet.
Well, thank you, Mr. Jeff, for that reading. Well, when I heard the title of this book, I thought, what is this all about? But it taught me something. Not to be sad when I can't do something right away. Sometimes it takes a while for some things to happen. And it's not that it won't happen. It just hasn't happened yet. <laughs> Oh, okay, everyone. I want to thank you for joining me for story time today. And please stop by and visit with me again. Also, remember to visit your local library for fun reading adventures. Until next time, happy reading. If you're looking for adventure, you want to unwind. What you're after, you're looking for